What's going on guys, today I'm going to be showing you the Beast 1.5, this is made for the Fire Stick, for any TV box that doesn't have that much RAM or the processor is not the greatest, this is a lightweight build, so it works for pretty much anything that uh, uh, has that low end processor or RAM like I said, so let's go and get started with the video, I'm going to be showing you first what you get and then I'm going to be showing you how to get it. So as you can see here, there's a nice build, you get different menus here, as you can see if we scroll to the side here, you get the different uh, sections. So we're going to start off with the movies here, uh, as you can see here you get four, diff well five different uh, add-ons here. Uh, like I said, this is for a lightweight, uh, this is a lightweight file, it's a lightweight uh, built for the fire stick or anything that doesn't have the greatest processor out there. So as you can see here, the movies, I recommend the one right underneath it, this uh, S-T-A-E-L. Just press enter, and as you can see here, you get the different movies here. I recommend this one because it works pretty well. I haven't had any problems with it. I just tried it a couple times and it works. I'm going to try the Martian here, and I'm going to open the first link, see if it works. Uh, this is uh, actually pretty simple, it's not like the other ones where you have to find the source and all of that, I really don't like that. So as you can see here, it's going to start buffering, uh, depending on your connection, it's going to work better. Uh, right now I'm using a Wi-Fi, so it's not working that well, and I think someone else is using the internet. So I'm not getting the best uh, buffering that I should be getting. So that being said, this is the movies, and if we go back to the beginning, We'll go and check out the TV shows and uh, everything else. So as you can see here, the TV shows, uh, if you go to the current TV shows, you'll get to see the ones that are airing right now. They update, uh, I think they update, yeah, they tell you when it was updated. So as you can see here, The Last Man on Earth. I don't know, I don't watch this show, but let's check it out. See how long it takes to open up. So just simple one click and it opens it up, as you can see right there. I'm going to go ahead and play it. I'm on the last man on earth. And as you can see, it works. So I'm going to go and back again. And then you have the live TV. I'm not going to go to the live TV because you guys already know. If you don't know, uh, the cloud TV is the best one. You'll find some there. But I don't know. I wouldn't get this for the TV because it's just hard. Uh, it's always You always have to be updating it or you always have to be on top of it if you actually want to get live TV. So uh, I don't know, I would recommend getting this just for the movies and, uh, and the TV shows. That's pretty much all. And then you have the add-ons here for the videos, the apps, again, the add-on system and power. Alright guys, so I'm going to be coming back and I'm going to restart the Kodi on a brand new uh, install. And then I'm going to be showing you guys how to get it. I'll be right back. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and get started with the uh, tutorial. You want to go and go on system, file manager, and we're going to be adding a new source. So you're going to go all the way down, double click on that source. For you, you're only going to have a couple options if you don't have anything else. So go ahead and click and double click none. And we're going to be adding this source right here, http semicolon slash slash spartan pixel dot net forward slash repo. Once you add this source, you can go ahead and click done. And we're going to be renaming the source to Spartan. So go ahead and delete this right here and name it Spartan. After that, you can go ahead and click done. And then you can uh, click OK right here at the bottom. It's going to take around 10 to 15 seconds to update the new uh, source. So we're going to go once that's done, you're going to go ahead and go back system add-ons. And we're going to go be we're going to be installing from zip file. So go ahead and click that. Go to the Spartan. And then install the wizard.zip. Once you install that, it's going to take around 15 to maybe 10 seconds. Uh, go ahead and do that. Once you install that, it's going to enable it. You'll get a little pop up here on the bottom or on the top saying that it's been enabled. Once that's done, you're going to go ahead and go on programs. And we're going to be uh, running the wizard for, I mean, the build for this one. So we're going to go and find uh, Spartan. It's probably the one you guys are only going to have this one. So right here, Spartan Wizard, and it's the Beast 1.5 Fire Sticks. So this one, like I said, it's a lightweight, lightweight uh, built. You guys can get this right here. Uh, I have a video for the Beast 1.4. I'm going to have an annotation right here so you guys can go check that out. 
and I'm gonna be doing some more videos showing you more builds and uh, soon I'll be having some wizards uh, for you guys those are different than the builds and I'm gonna be showing you guys those uh, soon so hopefully this work for you guys after you install it you click on it install it and uh, it's gonna you're gonna want to restart your device It's gonna ask you to unplug it don't click OK just uh, unplug your device uh, if you have a TV box, unplug your power supply. If you have a TV stick, unplug it from your TV. And that should be it. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And it's going to start installing. So I'm going to be back once it's done installing and downloading. I mean downloading and installing it. And I'll show you guys again the build. So I'll be right back. Alright guys, so as you can see here, it's done. To ensure all changes are safe, you must now close code and unplug your device from the TV or outlet and restart so uh, like I said before you have to unplug your TV box from the power supply if you have the TV stick you're gonna go ahead and unplug it from your power supply uh, once we're done here don't click OK just go ahead and do that because I'm running on a PC I'm gonna go ahead and restart Cody and I'll be right back alright guys as you can see here we're back and as you can see at the top here it's gonna start updating everything once you first get it, it's gonna update everything uh, in the fi uh, first five minutes, you should let it just update and uh, get all the items ready for you guys. So that's it, pretty much. That's it. If you guys need anything else, don't forget to leave a comment down below and I'll try to get to you guys as soon as possible. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos coming up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. We're chasing the easy life.